What's up everyone? Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. Let me show you around a little bit while we let some people come on. We are out in the Hamptons. We are in the parking lot of Dockers, actually on the dock of Dockers, out in the Hamptons on Dune Road. Foggy morning out here. But pretty. Who's on? Who's on? Who we got coming on? Who's awake? Who's awake? Who's awake? Force well, of average got everyone stuck to the bed this morning. There we go, there's Benny. There's Benny. Good morning, what, sir. What is going on, Brian? East meets west. <laughs> That's for sure. That's for what? sure. Check this one out. Oh, look at that. Your view's prettier than my view. I got the baby up. <laughs> Road. Go for it. Right here. Yep. Your audio, your audio is messing up a little bit. My audio is messing up. All right, it's better now. I got full signal. No earpiece. I have to check on that. I got mine on. You, you hear me good? Yeah, I hear you. Okay. Okay. So, right. uh, I didn't hear what you were saying, but uh, is that where you, where you were last night? <clears throat> uh, last night? Uh, where did I go last night? We went to uh, Oakland's last night. Had a live band going. And uh, let's see what's going on here. Let's see who else we can get on this. See if Chris is around. He said he might get on. Who else can we get on here? Oh, Paul Prison's that? got the garage happening today. Over on Limith Road in Malvern. Come buy all his junk. Hey, what kind of tools he's got? <laughs> Let's buy the beers out of the fridge. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'll buy the beer fridge. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and Marge and Uncle Frank are on. You guys out in the Hamptons? Who else? Who else is getting on? Let's see. Let's see. Quiet this morning. Saturday, man. It's a gloomy day. Nobody Most wants to get up. Man. Yesterday was last day of school for a lot of a lot of kids, so parents are probably just saying, you know what? I don't have to wake up early ever again. <laughs> well, for the summer at least. Uh -huh. Let's see who else. I'm gonna invite a whole bunch of people and see who shows up. I'm gonna invite a whole bunch of people. I don't want to walk too far away from my bike, but. <laughs> See. The bike. Yep. What? What? Right, call prison.
Paul, FYE, right here, Paul. <laughs> Paul. Can you hear me? Yeah, your, your audio is going in and out. It moved a little bit. Can you better? Yeah. Get closer to the building. Okay. Oh, what is going to get me? Hopefully that's better. Can you hear my voice better? Yep, a lot better. All right, we moved over. We moved over closer to the restaurant. All right, so uh, we got to get a message out today. Look, we talk. I'm thinking uh, learning. Are you learning? Every day, are you learning? every opportunity in life to learn are you open to learning are you keeping your eyes open are you are you looking for the results um, just talk about uh, are you getting for what you're doing are you I can't hear you at all. Your, your yeah. audio's in and out. My audio's in and out. Huh. Why that? Do I thought I go over you? Okay. All good? Still, it's getting better. Walk around a little bit. Walk around a little bit. Modern technology. Yeah. It's actually quiet today on the beach. Yeah, it's cloudy. Not, not, not too many people on the boardwalk, but which is which is cool. But still, people some out uh, some people out here. Yeah, yeah. But I, I think I think I heard something before about you know, your little message about learning. Um, I actually learned something today, Brian Stuman. Focus on your supporters and not the reporters. Yes, I heard that. And, you know, that's something that I struggle with because, you know, well, I think most people struggle with that, right? Because we, we're worried about the reporters all the time and we don't worry about the, the supporters. Um, and, you know, I take you for an exa as an example of, everyday message and showing people your supporters um, what your message is what you're learning what you're doing in life um, and you know I appreciate you and I'm pretty sure that there's a ton of people that appreciate you as well but I, that really I learned something today that I struggle with I struggle with that all the time I'm worried about my reporters why why do I have to worry about them I might be doing something a little bit better, something different. We're going live, right? We're doing something totally different, out of our element. Yeah, um, yep. out but, of your zone. Yeah, it's out of my comfort zone. And, and this is just a prime example of what, what we believe in, what we do. This is, this is it. I mean, we give back to our community 100%. And we take the message from somebody else. We learn it from somebody else. And we, we bring it into our lives and we show it to somebody else. So it's totally. a, it's a big circle. It's a big circle. And you know, it's a powerful message, man. No, it's tough all the time. Um, Hey. 
can't hear me? Okay. Okay. Full signal. <laughs> well, your head drums out. Is it better? You hear me, Ben? I hear you. You hear me? All right. Um, so in a world where uh, goodness speak up, all you see in the news, all you see in the world is bad, negative. And uh, you know what? we have got to be a force of hot against that and try and counteract the negative. You hear me now? I'm going to on one yes. leg. Stay, stay where you are. Stay right here. I won't move. Yeah. Um, so, you know what? People are going to hate. People are going to love. I stay in my lane. I do what I do. You either love me, you hate me. You know, it's uh, hopefully no one hates me. Uh, it's not my goal, but I'm sure sure as people have comments, you know what, whatever. If, uh, you know, if you don't like my family. But uh, I'm out there just trying to spread some love, trying to help some people. Um, I was on a two hour call, actually over two hour call. Uh, Apex executive, good dude. Um, Contractor, uh, go wheel house. And um, there's, with, with positive people, with people that are uh, making things happen, all the negative energy drops out and all the positivity starts growing. All the energy, the positive energy, the, 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 the part side to do things, to do good, to, to build business, to build relationships, all come from who you yourself with. Um, we all push each other. Um, we all hold each other. We are around people. The fire builds inside you. So, I can run people for fire with other people and hopefully have them before. Um, you know, we all have struggles in life. We all have stuff that goes on behind the scenes. We all have battles that we're fighting. Um, but we're not. One of the things I've learned a lot of guys have, you know, have been uh, way overweight. They tried to commit suicide. Um, they've been second and third marriages. They've had all kinds of bad stuff. You know what? They learned from the experience. They kept going. They didn't stop. So we're like. Need not step from under you, you know, saying you sit down and build. You know, uh, that wants to pop back up. Don't pop back up. You know, and then go rebuild. Um, well, I love, I love that, I love that saying. You know, like if you get knocked down, you know, don't get right back up. Stay yeah. there. Learn from it. Learn from that experience. Learn from it. Right. Suck, Why did suck you everything up? in. Yep. Take all that. That why did you get down, knocked down, and then rebuild from there, and then get back up with with full power, full knowledge, full experience, and you could just take it over. You know, take the world over, yep, take yep. your world over. But you know, the positive messages on the daily—it's just amazing. You know, I I I love it. I wish I could do this every day with you, but um, I'm solo today, and uh, I'm enjoying this little moment by myself after yesterday's little. Um, Little little tiff at work, um, but you know you helped me out tremendously yesterday with that little oh, too many call. Don't let anything lose take your joy. That's right, man. Nothing, and nothing is worth losing your joy over. Crap's gonna happen in life. It's gonna happen, and you know what? If you get excited about it, it just claims space in your head. You know, I, I you know, I've been there. I I still sometimes get fired up and I say, don't lose your joy. Don't lose your joy. You know, forgive it, move on, because it's not, it just eats you up. And you carry these things around that eat you up. And No, definitely. But you know what? That that I let go yesterday, that's behind me. You know, but yep. I, what I'm trying to say is the message that you helped me out with yesterday was just was just powerful. So that, that was a, a huge help. So I thank you for that. Uh, say, look for the signs. Look for the signs in life. Um, you know, uh, I don't consider myself a holy roller, but uh, I do believe in God. And I do believe that he... Shows us the way. Uh, you are uh, focused. You're supposed to be what's supposed to be happening. We know what we're supposed to be doing, and we go and get that. Um, if 
it feels right, go for it. If it doesn't feel right, uh, I feel it's done to me what God put in it inside of us to, to you know, put us in the right direction. Um, it's uh, a lot of times back in life, did something against your gut. Got an outcome that wasn't what you felt so bad about it. When, when your gut said, this feels right, I'm going for it. You know, when I decided to get my real estate, like, it came to me, and it's like, you're going to go take this place like, four years ago, right? In the team now, we'll push a million dollars in sales in the last four years. That, that, that's, that was right. That was the right move. You know, when I put the tech, and hung out with Tom Keenan and Jessica, and Jessica's the one who got me there, and it just felt right. And you know what? Go in. Joined entrepreneurs. And once, it's changed my life already. I'm not half plugged into the way I should. But when God tells you it's time to put it tells you it's time to get involved in this organization, um, you know, it felt right. And I did it. Um, now, I just hired a virtual assistant. Um, I, I just don't have enough time in a day. 80-20 uh, rule, you know, uh, get talked about a lot. Um, I waste a lot of time on on, on paperwork, on social media. Uh, I don't consider social media a waste of time. I think it's important to connect. But um, in order to do social media, you know, I take a bunch of pictures. I edit those pictures. Uh, I come up with a message. Um, and I share it on a different platform so everyone can see it. And uh, that takes a lot of time and a lot of effort. And that's something that um, my virtual assistant now can do. Uh, you know, I'll put the message out. It's always going to be me. It's always going to be my messages. But when it comes from taking it from Facebook and putting it on Instagram, putting it on LinkedIn, putting it wherever else I can get it, that's a virtual assistant job. Uh, when it comes to um, keeping my CRM up to date, uh, uploading all my data, that's my, that's my virtual assistant. Can you hear me again? I can't hear you now. I can't hear you. No. No. Lost you. No volume. Mm, we lost Benny. Maybe we can pull him back in. Who do we got watching us? Paul's still on there. Let's see if we can get Benny back in here. Can you hear me? Hey, I hear you now. Okay, sorry about that. Modern technology. Yes. <laughs> It's good and bad, right? Good and bad. Yeah, yeah. Um, good and so, bad, good and bad. So um, making changes in life, obviously, I got to free up some time. Um, I'm running myself ragged. And uh, so we did, we dove in, virtual assistant. You know what? Um, I networked um, with another realtor uh, at a closing. Uh, we hit it off. We it. And uh, what she's doing for her. But uh, I mean, but what? You know, for uh, the work is done. You know, so we're making proof. Talking about my, um, you know, we ride at dawn every day. Uh, we work. You don't get things in life to work. So I was at Oakland. There was a band. We had a lot of home. Oh Lord, hard. hard. And we're set. Five forty-five jumped on a bike. Forward morning. You're okay. Uh we're going to run off all the time. Uh we're still going to put it. So 
uh, about quality. For a while, to jump on our prep. Got the pressure. Yeah. Right, right. In the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, go on, go on in heaven. I will be the name. Be the... Thy, Thy kingdom hope. come, thy will be done will... on earth. earth as it is in heaven. Give us this give day our daily bread. Forgive give us, us our trespasses. trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. Yes. Lead us not into temptation. Yes. And deliver us from Amen. evil. Amen. Amen. Hail Mary. Grace. Holy Ghost. Lord. Holy Ghost. Holy Holy Mary. Mother of God. So pray, pray for us sinners now at the hour Amen. of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning. Uh, dear God, we help all my friends in the struggle of life. Positive to hurt and become better, become the best versions of themselves. You know, with like, with like who knows? Over 20 years. Don't wait. Don't wait. You would put work. Can hear you. Live it. Live it. Horrible volume today. <laughs> Any better? Any better? A lot better. Stay right there. <laughs> Stay yeah. right there. So why the volume's cut now? I got full signal out here. But all right. So anyway, so that's the message. Learn every day. Do the work. Follow your gut, and uh, just keep spreading some love. That's right, man. Yep. And just a couple, couple little things. Um, meeting, meeting every morning at Scarcliff, doing this 365 ride, doing it on the weekends. I mean, it's a little, it's a little commitment, but if you're consistent, you'll feel a difference, 100%. You just got to get out there and just get it done. Um, yep. It's, it's an hour of your time of the day. But think about that hour you're sitting on TikTok or on the couch. You could be actually exercising and hanging out with good people and having some good conversations. So with that being said, on the bottom, I'm going to do this for Brian. Plug whatever you got to plug. Comment below. If you like what you're seeing, comment below. Like it. Love it. And you know you can find Brian at, B, uh, what is it, B. Lewis Realty? Brian Lewis Realtor, Instagram, Facebook, uh, whatever platform you're on, just look for Brian Lewis Realtor or Brian Lewis RE if somebody uh, quit. Um, all the platforms out there. Well, uh, more platforms. But, um, and then Bench, Port, Painting, um, Malvern, we definitely in Elite Painting, there is a difference. Painted, rock spackled, all that stuff. Shout out to Benny. And also, anything in life, reach out. I'm a connector. Benny's a connector. We know a ton of people uh, that we use ourselves, that we can rely Having a bad day. You want, you want me? You know. You want to laugh? I'll try. I'm here. I'm here. We all go same, up, up same, 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 same thing here. I'm, I'm, I'm always around for everybody. Um, 
I mean, Brian, Brian's huge for me. So, um, and we do have, we do have that network and I really can't wait for Monday. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. <laughs> Monday's going to be yeah. a fun night. But, but Monday, uh, uh, Apex, New York meetup. Uh, I powerful, Zach. powerful people, powerful people. It was a brainchild of me and Zach. And, um, we, uh, we're going to meet up in uh, Queens with a bunch of uh, New York Apex people and uh, definitely going to be a powerful uh, dinner. Uh, the energy that you get off the Apex crowd is just amazing. You know, everyone thinks we're, uh, we're drinking the Kool-Aid, but... Uh, <laughs> so, uh, good people doing good things. Uh, beat the force of average. Most of like they completely turned the lights around. Right, miles and miles and miles. So that part. 26 days straight, six days I've been riding. Uh, we're doing over 100 miles a week now. Uh, we've been up in the game during the week. We did like 14 yesterday. On the weekends, we did like 23, I think, last Saturday. I'm going to probably put 23 in today. Um, I'd never, I'd take my bed, I'd sleep late, I'd turn over, I'd hit snooze. And, uh, you know, let life pass. You know what? Time to stop. 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 That's where we're at. We're, we're helping each other grow. And, uh. The thing. So, all right, I'm going to get back to ride it. I got to get back to Malvern today. I open house 11 to 1, 6 to 1 Lawrence. Uh, beautiful spot, location. Um, country cut. Oh, right part of Malvern walking. 6 to 1 Lawrence. 40 to 1. So, back to uh, home base. Jump in for Marrow, Blast home. Home for the open house, the left the one, and then from there, I got um, but it's open house is probably gonna go longer. We'll be there for one. That's good today. Home by 10, open house 11 to 1. And then, uh, what do you think? Uh, uh, call it his garage sale. Lynn broke. Turn. Almost. <laughs> I almost got nailed with water. Go see Brian. Uh, go see, uh, go see Call. Call, I'm going to stop by. I'm going to buy your house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Brian, thank you for having me on today. I appreciate it. I love you, brother. Um, Coming on. And, love um, you. guys, have, have a great day. Slay the day. Get out there. Get it done. And enjoy the rest of your enjoy your weekend first of all, but enjoy the rest of your Saturday. That's it, man. Enjoy, live life to the fullest. Spread love. God bless. Get it. You'll get it.